One of the most amazing things about working at Dior is having access to the archive. And the archive team are incredible. They know everything. Alors, FGH, si je sais il y a quelque chose, faut que je mette mes gants parce que c'est quand même la première collection. On rigole pas. So, Kim start asking them which pieces do you think are important from Mr. Dior's work and something that could be made contemporary. Un thème très 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 important, c'est le thème fleuri du printemps été 49. Miss Dior, robe du soir courte, brodée de mille fleurs. La forme est très très sobre pour mettre en valeur le relief des fleurs. It's really an icon of the house, and we wanted to keep that spirit as much as we could on a very embellished piece of knitwear. We used the same molds, the same silk bases to get these beautiful crisp flowers. We also played with the color combinations, off-white base with this range of pink. Some purples. Le sens des tissus, c'est le secret de la couture. Alors, Kim Jones y a été tout à fait intéressé par cette robe que nous avons rachetée à une grande cliente américaine. Malheureusement, nous n'avons aucun détail. C'est sans doute une fabrication peut-être spécifique pour elle. It's almost like a meadow of flowers, but quite spread out. There's a really interesting play with space, and we used it in some ways very simply, very simple tulle t-shirts, but in other ways layering it over fleece or a puffer jacket, something that feels like a rejuvenation of the original. One of Kim's favorite pieces from the archive is the Bobby perfume bottle. Le voici, c'est un objet un peu malicieux, un peu amusant quand même. Il y a beaucoup d'humour derrière ce petit chien. Le chien va avec la petite niche, c'est ce qui le rend précieux. Christian Dior adorait les chiens, des chiens simples. On le voit ici pendant la guerre à Calian, on le voit ici à Milly, on le voit ici boulevard Jules Sando. Et voilà le, le fameux Bobby qui a servi d'inspiration. How can we recreate Bobby? One way was working with really brand new embroidery technology. So each color area is programmed manually, and then the machine is able to select the correct color of sequins to create this feeling of fur. Mixing them with velvet and satin stitch applied on top of the blanket. The inspiration was Paris at dawn, and we see that in touches of rhinestones. It's a rhinestone fringe on a shoe. It's a rhinestone applique on a glove. One extraordinary vest made completely of rhinestone jewelry. So it's these little specks of sparkle that are picking out the last stars of night as the colors in Paris are starting to come alive. 